Hi everybody, I'm Alyssa from cloudmom.com. So you might have noticed that I didn't put out a video last week and I'm a little bit behind the eight ball as they might say and full disclosure that definitely is the truth. Even though I'm the queen of like preparation and getting organized and making a plan with two kids now in middle school and a fourth grader and my little one starting kindergarten, I was caught totally unprepared. This video is about why and what I've been trying to do to fix it. We live in an apartment in New York City and up until last year, we've really been able to have most of our older kids at our big dining room table doing homework and that works out just fine. The problem is we also have a piano in that room and it's right smack in the middle of our apartment where everybody enters the apartment and leaves the apartment. So it's sort of a high traffic area and one that doesn't exactly lead to good concentration. So the school year basically hit me like a Mack truck because nobody really had a good workspace where they could put their books, put their binders, put a laptop, although nobody has their own laptop. We have mine and my husband said everybody shares for their homework, but they needed a place to put all this stuff and be in a quiet environment, in a calm environment so that they could get their work done, which is obviously really a priority. Now, this required some really deep reflection on my part. You know how attached to my baby furniture I am. Those of you who followed Cloud Mom, I spent like seven years in my nursing chair. It was so hard to get rid of that. I still had my changing table in my girls' room. This stuff just had to go. I had my mother drive up in her big old station wagon. We packed it up. It's going in her basement. I just had to say bye-bye to that baby furniture into the baby years and start to look toward the future in order to accommodate my kids' growing and changing needs. I went on Ikea and I found these awesome desks. They're only $25 each. And I found these cool chairs that are adjustable so they can work for a smaller or a larger child. So basically I started to kind of clear out the past and make way a little bit for the future, which is really hard for me, but I did not have the choice. And one thing I'm really excited about is that each kid is gonna have a bulletin board over their desk where they can put photos or calendars or you know little things from their day or information about things they're interested in. Sorry, you can tell I'm tired and sleep deprived with school starting. And that's really nice for them because they're gonna have like a little piece of their own real estate, whereas they've never had that because my three boys are in one room and my two girls are in another. So we're still struggling with homework and getting homework done, but I feel very relieved that at least I have a plan for having these desks, which are pretty good size for kids in their bedroom so that, so that each of them is gonna have a quiet place to work. And they were reasonable too. Now I just need that Ikea delivery truck to arrive. And when it does, I'm gonna shoot another video, show you guys all my workspaces, and you can tell me what you think. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you guys again soon on Cloud Mom. Thank you.